Okay, I'm at the Home Builders Association show. You know, and so many people, you go out to the deck, you go out to the backyard, they'll see one of these, kind of a fire pit, a fire ring. Can you see that right there? Okay, now yeah, you set that on the ground, you set that on the patio, that's one thing. But we're gonna show you a way that you can kind of dress it up. And with me is Jared Carr with Acme Brick. Jared, thanks for being with us. Do appreciate it very much. Now what you've got is really a simple way to kind of, I guess, really dress up kind of a fire pit. Why don't you tell me a little bit about this? Right. These are uh, concrete block. Uh -huh. uh, made, they're, they're designed specifically to, to this circumference so that this fire ring fits right inside. Right. This is kind of like a whole kit is what right. you're talking it's, about. It's a, it's a mortarless application. Uh -huh. It requires nothing more than stacking brick. Stacking okay. Block. Just stacking block. Yep. So, and, 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 you know, for someone like me who really is not a bricklayer, do you have to prepare the ground in any special way? If you've got soft ground, it's got a lot of topsoil on it, you might want to take those first couple inches of topsoil off, maybe mm -hmm. put a, a little gravel down first, just to, to make a nice, a nice level bed. Okay, that, but we're not talking about having to put rebar or anything. No, no rebar, no, you don't have to pour pad, you don't have to pour any concrete. Let's let's run through this a little bit. Show me show me what we need to do because we've got a couple of, of layers already on. So let's show folks how really easy something like this is right. to do. Well, really? where do we go from here? Uh, like that, that, the first thing you do, you set that ring down, you get that first layer around Okay. It. Okay. And, and that, then you're just kind of building from your, there. Yep, that sets your circumference. After that, you're just staggering the joint. Okay. So Block right in the, and right then you just do the same for the third ring. Is that yep. right? Right in the middle. And really, I mean, this is this is solid built. So again, you're not having to deal with rebar or anything along that line, right? right. These are 25 pounds a piece. Okay. They're not going to blow away or probably like not. That. <laughs> Okay, and this doesn't really, I mean, you know, I, I have to say that the, the, the gentleman who came in here earlier, they set those two rings up in probably maybe five minutes or so. So as long as you've got some level ground to deal with, this will go together fairly quickly. All right, so now we've yep. built the circle here. Now we're going to take the ring, right? Yep. All right, let's move that in here. So there. Just kind of fit that in and try not to smash my fingers in the min meantime. Yep. So now you've got your pit, and really it's all ready. You just kind of put your logs in there. Yep. Now what if you don't like, you know, this kind of tan color? Are these available in different colors? Right, we've got five colors, and they're offered in two styles. Okay. This is a tumbled style. It kind of roughs up the edges, knocks the, right. knocks the sharp edges off. Or if you want a more clean look, untumbled. All right, and it's solid. You can stand on it. Everything right here, just a different way to dress up a fire pit if you want one out in the yard. Perfect thing to do, easy to make. And this comes in a kit? Uh, between $250, $300. There you are, and you've got a really beautiful fire pit. So that's just one of the things that they have at the Home Builders Association show. We're gonna look at something a little bit later, but I have to catch my breath. I've just been doing stonework. Back to you. <laughs> Tom, that is right up your alley up with the testosterone. You just built a fire pit. <laughs> we are so terribly impressed. <laughs> Thanks, Tom.